This is Sway. 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 In the morning. In the morning. In the morning. Shake your body. Wake your fuck ass up. That crust out your eyes. Yeah. Is that weird? Wow. That was an excerpt from the movie Wish I Was Here. It's in theaters right now. Yep. Uh, Zach Braff has uh, directed it, right? Co wrote it with his brother and also starring in it. And alongside him is one of the most beautiful actresses. <laughs> I'm just going to go ahead and hound out, Heather. Oh, it's her first gosh. time on the show. Oh, okay, man. Make, make Kate feel welcome. Yeah, listen, man. <gasps> Ever since the almost famous days, uh, How to Lose a Guy in 10 Days. <laughs> Fool's gold. Fool's you, gold. You, Yay. me, and Dupree. Wow. I've always had a crush on Kate Hudson. She's here today, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. She's here. Thank you. <laughs> Welcome to the show. Yes. Thanks. I'm glad to be here. We're going to make you as comfortable as we can. Okay. Nothing scandalous is going to come out of this interview. All right. You're safe here. You're in a uh, safe zone. Okay. This is your first round. Second round, we'll get to all that stuff. <laughs> 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 this round, you're in a safe zone. Okay. Um, first and foremost, uh, we've been noticing that a lot of uh, people in the film industry have to adjust uh, to how the industry has changed. Mm -hmm. and, and, and Similar to how the music industry changed. Same thing, right? Ago. Yeah, it's yeah. really similar. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and, and, and even in the way that you guys approached making this movie uh, was unconventional of sorts. You guys went out and you raised money for it, right? Yeah, Zach, Zach uh, decided to do the Kickstarter thing. Yeah. And the how that goes is you basically reach out to your fans and see if they want to, to help you out uh, with the project and back mm -hmm. your project. And it was very successful for Zach. Yeah. Um, the fun, I, I didn't really know what to think about it. I didn't really know much about it. I'm not a tech girl. You know, I'm not yeah. like a social media person. I mean, I just started my first Instagram. What's your, Instagram? <laughs> What's your Instagram account? It's my name. Oh, jeez. I'm about but to but I have like two posts. <laughs> but but the, but the thing is, 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 is that, you know, I, I, was, I wasn't really aware of it. And then, um, and then I, 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 I got into it. And all, all of a sudden, all the backers were coming on to the set. And we were meeting all the people that were backing our movie. And. They were so kind and loved film and really, really like respectful fans of Zach. And it was a really cool experience. It mm -hmm. was very different. You almost felt like you were you you had an extra added love to give back to the to Zach's fans, yeah. you know, yeah. because at the time I didn't have anything to do with the movie when he raised the money. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so it was, it was it was pretty cool. So let me get this right. So because I always wonder what did what does the fan get from this? So they could come on set. Well, with, no, there's all sorts of stuff. It's a it's a it's a whole it's a you know it, it depends. I mean, it in in Zach's uh, situation, he created um, all kinds of things that you get mm -hmm. as a, as if it's like it's like subscribing to be a, an exclusive part of the movie. Mm -hmm. So whether it be you know, behind the scenes, yeah. um, video footage, uh, naming a character. Um, you get an early, early uh, draft of the script. Yeah. Um, you see the movie at certain screenings. Mm -hmm. You go to premieres. There's all sorts of things that yeah. Jack it's, created. Yeah, it's really cool because you get different initiatives, sort of. Like, with what you give sort of depends. Sometimes you might get a cool postcard of the cast. Like, it's so cool that when they do a Kickstarter and, and you get to raise money and see a project from beginning to end. It's a great way to raise money for film. It was also interesting to see, again, in the whole social media world, how when you interact with the fan and then you actually bring them into the process, yeah. that they, that, that it, it's, it's, they actually, I think their love for a movie and their support for a movie actually grows. They see what goes into making mm -hmm. it. They're not so easily uh, critical yeah. because they're actually we're we're bringing them in on the process and 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 they feel a part of it. It's 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 fun. They it feel was like different. That, that, that you have proprietorship in it, and then the fan becomes your own street team because <laughs> they go out and promote it. <laughs> yeah. Right? Yeah. Uh, Sarah Bloom is your character. Who is yeah. she? She is. Uh, I play Zach Braff's very I, everybody calls her a supportive wife but i i kind of feel like she's his biggest cheerleader um but when you meet them their family has sort of entered into crisis mode uh -huh. dad falls ill um zach is uh you know actually still acting quite selfishly in his life in terms of trying to follow his dream but not really 
supporting his family or mm-hmm. doing anything to support his family. And I'm in the thankless job putting food on the table for our kids. And it's time for me as a wife to kind of tell my man to step up. Have you ever had to do that in real life? I think with every relationship I've ever had. <laughs> That's <laughs> real. Hey, <laughs> no, step I up, mean, dog. <laughs> I think that everybody, whether you're male or female, at some point, if you're in a good relationship, you're always going to have the moment. Because mm-hmm. I've been told that, too. And, yeah. You know, um, there always comes a point in a relationship when you go, okay, you got to step this up. Yeah. Yeah. You got you to... Gotta, figure that one I'm out. Sorry, I've been told that. I was told that last night. <laughs> oh, wow. I showed you the picture. Oh, when yeah, you I, showed me the picture. I showed yeah. a picture of my socks on the floor, oh, and someone oh. was telling me, you need to pick up. Start you, picking yeah. up. Yeah. You need step, to pick step, up. step up and pick up, right? <laughs> let, let, let me ask you this question. Kate Hudson is hanging out with us. <laughs> I became a fan of yours through your mom. Mm-hmm. Goldie Hahn, bless that woman, I swear. <laughs> As a child, man, I've just, you know, she she stayed in my fantasies. I don't mean to freak you out here. Yeah. But do you... Re- oh, that doesn't freak you out. <laughs> I got okay. it, I got it. Okay, okay, you can handle this? Yeah. <laughs> Nobody remembers this scene from Private Benjamin. Tell me if you remember this. I'm, I'm sure I do. Kitchen scene, Bill Murray, wooden spoon, stovetop, countertop. Bill Murray. Was it Bill? No, but uh, who co-starred with her? In in <laughs> Private Benjamin. <laughs> Private Benjamin was um, I Albert Bro- Brooks. Albert Brooks. And it was um, it was Eileen Brennan. Brennan. Uh huh. Yeah. And it was uh, Armand uh, Armand Armand, Armand Desante, I think. Wasn't it Armand Desante? Armand Desante. Yeah. <laughs> so Bill Murray <laughs> not Bill Murray no. or maybe it's wrong guy who was no no you're thinking of seems like old times with seems like Chevy Chase Chevy Chase no that's not what I'm thinking yes you are you're thinking that with Chevy Chase <laughs> well, that's the when daughter. she's in the kitchen yeah and he shows up at the door and what does he do and it's and he and and I forget he's sort of I forget are they Flirty. Playing around, flirting with each other. Yeah, they're flirting, but he comes in and he, but she's like married, based. She's like with her, you know, she's with uh, Grodin, Charles Grodin. Wait, that's why I'm confusing. You're confusing me right now, Kate. We're going to come back with this. We're going to look it up. I'm going to look this up. Right now. And we're going to come back with this, all right? Either way, they're two brilliant movies. Brilliant movies, movies, right? (laughs) And your mother is one amazing. Tell her she has a fan of me. Okay, I Even will. though I'm confused her movies. <laughs> All right. Kate Hudson is here. I want to play a game with you called Knowledge of Self. Okay. And we're going to dig deep into your past and see if you remember some things. All oh, right. Geez. Sway in the morning, Shay 45. Kate Hudson has joined us. Sway in the morning, Shay 45. We're going yeah. over something here, man. <laughs> Talk about Hold it. Hold up, Kate. <laughs> Okay, you can't come on the show and tell me I'm wrong about this, Kate. You are wrong. I'm wrong? <laughs> you are so wrong. Private Benjamin didn't have the spoon scene. No, but but Bill Murray had a spoon scene. I think there was a spoon in Stripes. 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 It's Stripes. Uh-huh. <laughs> I just lost a stripe right there. Yeah. The, the good news is by association, I just worked with Bill Murray. Uh, so now you can, now in, in about a year, you can say, no, I just think I got a little bit confused. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> it was like Kate and Bill and Goldie and the spoon. Okay, okay, okay. okay. <laughs> All right, Kate, thank you for clarifying that. All right, but Bill Murray, I met recently at a Lady Gaga concert. This is fact. Okay. All right. Uh, when they just closed um, the uh, like what's the hall? They just closed right down the street here in New York City. She did the last performance right. at, at Roseland. At Roseland, yeah. And Bill they Murray was there. Roseland. And, and Bill Murray was a fan of Lady Gaga. And but I got a chance to talk to him. What did you work with him on? I just finished a movie in Morocco called uh-huh. Rock the Casbah. How fun was it working with him? Oh, forget it. Yeah, that was yeah. It's that. I mean, as a you know, I like making comedies, and and you know, the, you have certain comedians that you always just hope, like dream that you could work with. Mm-hmm. So when I got that opportunity, and I was thinking about it, I was like, I'd do this. I would. I mean, I I'd, I'd do anything in this movie just to have you know a scene with him. Yeah. Turns out, I got to play his his love interest. <laughs> Oh, no. Bill Murray? Bill Murray? <laughs> yeah. 
Oh, yeah. So you pretty much did anything. Huh? Oh, <laughs> I, I went there. Yeah. Uh, no, yeah, I play a hooker. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So um, it's very, it's fun. It was very <laughs> fun, interesting. Kate plays a hole. I, I, in, in the movie, I, I do. Yeah. I do. That's, that's my vocation. And, um, <laughs> And so it lent itself to some really great comedy with with Bill Murray, who wow. is a true master, and uh, it was really fun. You worked with uh, Kevin Hart years I ago. I did. Right? I love Kevin. Before Kevin was Kevin. He's my favorite. Yeah. Oh, we had a fun time. We were in Australia for six months together. Uh-huh. Yeah, so we, we got to know each other pretty well. Yeah. Kev is really funny. He's a funny guy at all he times, is right? His, crazy. His, his, his recent <laughs> success, though, is... Amazing. I mean, you get to you worked with him years ago, first time, right? Mm-hmm. Almost faint was it almost faint? Let me before I uh, let me ask you. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, yeah. sway! Be, be, before I ruin it, we, this is just this is <laughs> just Kate. Time. Just help him out, yeah, Kate. I just went so off the top funny. freestyling with you, Kate. You know, um, you work with with Kevin Hart on Fool's Gold. Fool's Gold. Yeah. You also worked with Jimmy Fallon too before, right? I worked with Jimmy Fallon, Fallon on, on Almost, almost famous. famous. Yeah. Okay. Wow. So you work with these guys before they became who they are. Yeah. Well, yeah, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. Did you see their potential? Although, then? yeah. D- yeah. Oh, uh, absolutely. Yeah. So for, for, I mean, but, you know, almost famous for us was we were all in that boat yeah. together, you know. Mm-hmm. And so Jimmy and I became very close. I just, he, he really made me laugh. He was one of those guys that I just was like, he's the kindest, sweetest. Yeah. So we became you know, good friends. Although I kind of become friends with everybody. That's kind of funny. I that, like wait, wait, people. Does that mean we're... We'll be friends. We'll be friends? Oh, yeah. Be friends with and, then, and then, <laughs> and then uh, but, but, um, and then Kevin, Kevin was, yeah, I mean, that, to me, I, I almost was wondering why Kevin hadn't, at that moment, been, mm-hmm. you know, hadn't, hadn't gotten there yet. Mm-hmm. Because, He's just so, uh, he's really deeply funny. Yeah, oh, yeah, he's, yeah. And he's kooky, and, you know, and he's and he's another sensitive one. He's yeah. super sensitive, he's really loving, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, he's a good, he's a really good person. Yeah, yeah. And um, so, he's he's one of those people you meet and you work with and you really root for because you, you, you respect how good of a person they are, you know. I, I think you're one of those people as well, Kate Hudson. Yeah. And, um, I don't think so. you know, <laughs> you know, on purpose, I was mixing up your information. Oh God! Uh, to give us, bring us to this moment. <laughs> oh God! <laughs> Claire, maybe I'm a little nervous. Heather, am I nervous? Yeah. You've been spraying <laughs> cologne all day. You've been getting ready. You've been bragging, yeah. and now you get here. The moment of and truth, and you're you nervous. Are, you are falling apart. Yeah. <laughs> oh God, day. Like right in front of you. Like man. <laughs> All right, so Kate Hudson is here, and we came up with this game called Knowledge of Self. Oh, jeez. And then we're going to go back <laughs> back into the time and see if you know some of the things you've, well, obviously you do, but some of the things you've already done. I'm scared. Let's do Knowledge of Self. It's now time for Knowledge of Self. self, 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 self. You don't know what you're doing. On Sway in the Morning. <laughs> you don't know shit. <laughs> <laughs> DB? <laughs> All right, Kate, this is how it works. We're going to play a clip for you, and you have to guess what movie it came from. Oh, my God. Okay. All Where's right. the clip? Let's see. Ready? Clip number one. I would have gone home with anybody last night. I just wanted to get it over with. Uh, 200 cigarettes. Correct. Oh, yeah. oh. Damn, I was hoping she got it wrong, so I wouldn't feel so oh, bad. Sweat. All right, all right. All right. Let's oh, hear clip man. number two. I can't believe you would dangle this in front of me. I can't believe it. Shit. Got her. I can't believe you would dangle this in front of me. I can't believe it. No, no, no. I can't believe you would dangle this in front of me. I can't believe it. Is it How to Lose a Guy in 10 Days? Oh! Raising Helen! Fool's gold. Oh, oh, right, of course. Yes, you're worse than me. Of course. All right, okay. <laughs> I can't believe you dangle this in front of me. I can't right, believe right. it. That was the first scene between Matthew and I. Correct. All right, clip number I, three. Actually, in a weird way, he was really inspiring. Uh, I can't believe you're doing this to me. <laughs> <laughs> 
actually. Can America. we play for shots of vodka? If Kate <laughs> missed another one, <laughs> if I she need missed a shot. Another one, you yeah, want a shot of vodka? Tequila, probably. Wait, can I hear that again? Go ahead, play that back. Actually, in a weird way, he was really inspiring. I can't believe it. This is horrible. Yeah, you've done so much. You understand my pain now, right? <laughs> you can see the. No, because when you say it, I'm going to remember it. You know. All right, go ahead. Let her know. Let her you, know. me, and Dupree. Wow, oh. the legendary one. Oh. <laughs> that was sick. That was sick. That's that not so bad. One. Let's let's, let's okay. switch it up a little bit. Let's switch All it up. All right. Okay. Let's hear clip number four. Ask me to go. Ask me to leave this house immediately. Well, well you got to explain that a little bit. That's All right. not me. Exactly. It's not. it's not you, but who is it? <laughs> okay, do it again. Ask me to go. Ask me to leave this house immediately. It's my mommy. That's right. Ah! And, that, <laughs> and that is from... Do you know what that's from? Yes. Okay, play it one more time. <laughs> Ask me to go. Ask me to leave this house immediately. Is that from Protocol? Mm, no. What, what is it? Death Becomes Her. Death oh. Becomes Her. Wow. Oh, let's do one more. One more. All right. Last it's, one. It's not... This is an easy one. I love that And if you movie. get this wrong, it's going to be kind of a... sad. Oh, no. All right. I've never done that. Wow. You know, picked up girls from everywhere else, but never from China. Yes, Jack Burton. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. Kate Hudson knows My her favorite. stuff. All right. Um, well, that was fun. Jack Burton, that's one of my favorite dad's character ever from Big Trouble in Little China. And that movie, we still watch that movie. The kids love that movie. Yeah. And when he, when there's a great line, when he comes out and he sees Kim Cattrall and he comes out and he goes, if I'm not out by dawn, call the president. <laughs> like the greatest line wow. ever. Tell, tell him that's I'm so a funny. big fan of his as well. Oh, I uh, will. Uh, please do. And tell your mom as well. Kate Hudson, thank you for stopping yes, by. Yes, thank, thank you for having me. Come back. This okay. And you guys, don't forget the movie is Wish I Was Here. It's yep. In theaters now. Support Kate. Support the movie. Support Yay. Zach. Support the process. Please, of, you'll love it. Um, Any closing words, Kate, if you want to the um, audience? No, but, you know, next time I come, I have a feeling you're going to know your... Oh, yeah, man, I'm gonna be all on top of it, man. <laughs> you know, I, honestly, I've been, I've been, you know, I've interviewed a lot of people from the president on down, but this probably. Have you ever seen me so nervous? <laughs> it was the cologne thing, Sway, this morning. You were, you were too excited. I got too excited. I psyched myself out. Yeah, you was like, I yo, she's coming, movies. she's coming. Like, it, it, I love her mother. I love her. I love her mother. I can't wait to tell her. All day. Kate Hudson, ladies and gentlemen, Yo-hoo! on Sway in the Morning. She's a citizen of Sway in the Morning. Yes, she is. It's Sway in the Morning. Only on Shade 45.